Hello, welcome to Anton's TV. My name is Jack and today I'm clutching the Nord Piano Monitor Monitors. You're clever people out there, I know you are. You understand that we can't really demo what these speakers sound like. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna unbox these and try attach them to this Nord Piano 4, which I understand they attach to. And in the process, I'm going to narrate to you in my Dorset tones the features of this product. Let's do it. Oakley Doakley, you just very excitingly watched me unbox these and I read a little bit about the specs of it and from the website. As I said before, there's no real way of conveying to you what these sound like, but luckily I'm always accompanied by a small, but powerful bird. And by the name of the Maltese Falcon, can I hear you caca? There he is. <laughs> now, there he is. As you see, we kind of ramshackily set these up. Don't know if that's a word, just made it up. Few notes on the setup, right? Got it out of the box, they smell great. Amazing, beautiful box, I dig it. Get this little accessory thing, you also get two kind of two length stereo cables here for plugging it in. I must admit, the wind was taken out of my sails somewhat by the lack of brackets. And after a quick Google, we realized that you also need to buy the brackets as well. Is it a kick in the balls? I think a small, a, just a little nudge in the balls. It's not a lot more money, but uh, anyway, you need to buy the brackets as well. They look delicious. I kind of love the fact they're traditional, the power amps in here and it's slaving to this. The reason why we've got it pointed out is that, as I said, I have the Maltese Falcon here. And instead of me saying what they sound like, he's used to hearing the speakers from behind here. I think this is more objective. We're gonna get an objective Maltese opinion. We might even get it in Maltese, if we're lucky, okay? Uh, can you give me a key, please, Chris? F. Thank you, brother. What do you think, mate? Sounds, sounds pretty good, actually. I'm pretty, I'm pretty impressed. It's, it adds a very, um, like, acoustic, almost, element to the sound of it, because normally you hear a Nord from, like, studio monitors or stage monitors, but it's nice to have a, a set of perfectly tuned speakers for, to go hand in hand with it. It, so, it sounds, it adds a nice bit of realism. That's the first time I played a note with these speakers and yeah. I'm sat behind them and I've, I was like, oh, hang on a minute. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. It, it's funny. I'm gonna have, let's have another key. Let's go with D. I'm gonna go D, I'm gonna put a Rhodes in it and we'll see what it sounds yeah. like. Um, Interesting. It's cool. It's 
like, yeah, you nailed it in the fact that it seems to be only dealing with the the range you want it to deal with. Because, like, normally, if I play the rose so patch of, of, you know... It's a bit woofy. Uh, yeah, or else there's, there's a, an over amount of, of low end, whereas this is, like, the, the low end is already... It's sweet, isn't it? It's like yeah, they've yeah, mixed yeah. it. Exactly, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's weird, like... I know you can't hear it, but it's a real feeling because we're so used to these atoms in the back yeah. and they're, sometimes we plug it, it's like, <laughs> it blows, blows the world up. Um, interesting. I was very, very skeptical about these. Yeah. And I think that if you do play this a lot and it's, if you're lucky enough that this is like your at home piano that you practice on, uh, especially, if you don't have the brackets, it comes with these little rubber feet. So if you've got an old Nord Stage 2 or whatever, this, and you point these back at yourself, it's pretty cool, actually. Yeah. Like, it's, if you're pushed for space, you can't get speaker stands. It's up against the wall. These are small enough. Um, you only need a little bit of a hangover at the back, and, uh, yeah, we're regularly hung over. So it's cool. That is interesting. Yeah, we've got these in stock. Come try them out. If you're not around Anderton's and you want to hear these, you can order these. It's pretty easy money back. You've got 30 days money back on this bad boy. So one of the type of things you could buy and see if it just suits your setup, suits your playing. Very, very interesting. One of those things, if you've had a good Christmas, like you've had a good Christmas or you've had a good summer, you've done a lot of gigs, and you've got a Nord at home and you just want to treat yourself. Treat yourself to these speakers, because that was posh. It was. I'm going to switch to the Velvet Grand. Cool. And I'm going to leave you with a little bit of something inappropriate. If you like what we're doing here, please consider subscribing. If you don't, let us know in the comment section. I'm going to leave you with a bit of Ignition by R. Kelly, because it just seems inappropriate and appropriate at the same time. A bit like this product.